Obviously, when you're going to recreate a home and using reclaimed materials, reclaimed materials, of course, the cost is going to be much higher than a new material. Could be lumber, timbers, flooring, boarding, the windows and doors as well. If we have to recreate a door or a window, just a window, maybe they are single pane, they have restoration glass that we will have to use and match. Now we have to go with a more custom window maker that is going to be all manual construction to replicate the existing. And it's going to be two times, three times the cost. Whenever you are using the reclaimed material or the material to match the existing home, it's going to be more expensive, substantially. The code compliance will be, of course, one of the challenges. We would also be looking, of course, at the insurance company to be able to work with the architect and the homeowner to recreate the home as it existed. But we have to upgrade it to meet the new codes and the new standards, particularly when it comes to energy conservation. Also, there is a little bit of a challenge on the approval process, perhaps, where in some of our towns we have architectural review boards or historic commissions that will have to monitor and to go now through the whole additional processes to get an approval to obtain a building permit, which is a challenge that could probably impact on the timing. People do understand that when you explain to them. Probably they are educated already. If not, we'll have to go through the process of coaching them and explaining, you know, and showing them alternate prices. I think architecturally, of course, it is challenging and very rewarding to recreate the home, to bring it up to codes, and to bring it back to its original glory.